Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be showing you how to beat Erling in Legacy Peace. And yes, of course, when you're walking in, make sure not to attract the other NPC with Sanji's attack style. Now, it might be more difficult in a public server because the leg will sometimes mess up the animations and the combos, but you can still do it. And with some luck, you should be able to take zero damage from the boss. Uh, so I do suggest a private server if you want the maximum efficiency for grinding Erling or, well, just beating him. But it's definitely doable. It's just going to be a tiny bit harder. So the combo just revolves you shuffling between your first ability or well, auto attack first ability auto attack third ability auto attack and then second ability and after that as okay well let's see as you can see here the third ability auto and then kick away second ability after that he will go into shooting mode and then it will be bite charge in which case you can just jump over four jumps if he is far away when he started five jumps if you're close right initiate auto for the spinning, it's going to be a little tricky. You you want to wait one second before pressing the spinning kick. Or if you find this count to one second being inconsistent, you can press the Z button when he just does the flip animation. Because if not, the cooldown between the next ability time and your auto attacks wouldn't let it activate. So you're going to get hit by air lane. Which would suck. Anyway, so that's the entire combo you have to do on this guy. Just make sure to avoid the water pellets and the uh, chomp thing that he does, which does a lot of damage. And yeah, you should be able to just five combo this guy and the battle should take around two minutes. Have fun. See you guys in the next video. Well, I know. Oh yes, make sure to like and subscribe. Mm-hmm, yep, see ya.